Kick rocks, unpack in English slang. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel where we explore fun, quirky, and sometimes confusing English phrases. Today, we're diving into the phrase, kick rocks. Ever heard someone say it and wondered what on earth it meant? Well, you're in luck. Today, we're breaking down this phrase so you can understand it and use it correctly in conversation. So, let's get started. Kick rocks is a slang phrase that is often used to tell someone to go away or to leave in disappointment. It's a less formal way to express dismissal and can sometimes be used playfully among friends. However, be careful with its usage as it can come across as rude if used in the wrong context. The origin of kick rocks isn't clear-cut, but it's generally thought to have emerged from the visual of someone so dejected and without purpose that all they have left to do is kick at the rocks on the ground as they walk. This image ties in with the feeling of being dismissed or rejected, akin to being told to take a pointless walk. Using kick rocks in a sentence can vary based on the context. Here are a few examples to help you get a better grasp. If he's not going to contribute to the project, he might as well kick rocks. She told me to kick rocks when I asked for a second chance. When I saw the price tag, I just kicked rocks and left the store. In each of these examples, the phrase is used to indicate rejection or the action of leaving out of disappointment or frustration. It's important to know when it's appropriate to use certain slang. Kick rocks is best used in informal settings among peers or friends. It's not appropriate for formal occasions, like job interviews or when speaking with someone in a position of authority. Remember, tone and relationship matter. A playful tone among friends can make kick rocks lighthearted, but in a serious altercation, it can be quite offensive. If you're looking for a less slangy way to express the same sentiment, consider phrases like, please leave. I think it's time for you to go. You might want to exit the conversation. These phrases can convey the same message without the casual slang and with varying degrees of politeness. And there you have it. You now know what kick rocks means, where it might come from, and how to use it or not in conversation. Remember, learning English isn't just about the formal stuff. Understanding slang and idiomatic expressions is a big part of getting fluent. Hope this video helps you on your language learning journey. Keep practicing, and don't be afraid to sprinkle some slang into your conversations where appropriate. Catch you in the next video.